Hi, I am Anita. Hi, I am Della. Hi, I am Hana. And my name is Insan. And in this video, we would like to explain all about semantics. And then the second is grammatical meaning. We can know it by showing how the sentence has similar or the same referring expression or predicate. And then the third is referential and non-referential. The meaning is words that have meaning is called referential. And words that have not meaning is called non-referential. And then the fourth is conceptual and association meaning. Conceptual is meaning by word have been free from context and association is meaning by word agree to their is. Okay. And I want to explain. The fifth is contextual meaning is the word available in one context. Denotative and connotative are two principal methods of describing the meaning of word. The meaning of word is lexical, denotative, or conceptual meaning. The meaning of term is often said free of context, while the word is not free of context. Idiom is a phrase when the word have a meaning that is different from dictionary. Proverb is a simple saying that expressing a truth based on common experience. Are you done? Remember it? Yeah. I understand now. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, you're yeah. welcome. You're welcome. A relation meaning? Uh, I'm sorry, I don't know. What is relation meaning? Relation meaning? So relation meaning is a semantic relation that exists between one language unit and another. There are several kinds of uh, relation meaning in linguistic, such as synonym, antonym, polysemy, homonym, hyponym, ambiguous, and redundant. Factors are an advance in science and technology, the social development of culture, development of the world, and an exchange of sense and the association. That's it. 